pathology is that physician, scientist, that you may not know. You rarely will see us, but we see you constantly. When you are born, we type your blood. If there is a little lump, we are going to be there to help you and your physicians beat the disease. They wanted to bring a mission and a vision into pathology to bring pathology to the center of patient management. Carlos Cordon Cardo is a world famous pathologist who has seamlessly incorporated data science and genomics into improving the diagnosis of cancer. During the pandemic, Carlos developed crucial assays for the diagnosis of COVID-19 and for monitoring immunity. What drives me essentially is that sense of curiosity and that journey that brings us into new spaces. Dr. Corin Cardo has revolutionized cancer therapeutics, in particular for bladder cancer and prostate cancer, and our understanding of why it starts and why these cancers progress. He has helped create the discipline of molecular pathology, which was a non-existent discipline a couple of decades ago. We are interested in better defining the cell in which the origin of some diseases may happen. Over the years, we have learned which are the markers, how to address these markers, how to better use them. Prostate cancer now is a disease that we cure in many, many, many instances, and bladder cancer is a disease in which new paradigms are being tested. During COVID, Dr. Cordon Carter's leadership was critical. One of the reasons that Mount Sinai led the world in the early days of the pandemic was because of his vision. His leadership during the early stages of the COVID pandemic was to take discoveries that were being made in the laboratory and to rapidly bring them into a clinical testing laboratory. And so we could perform those tests literally at the bedside. We felt that we were a team working with a larger team in a way that, like in music, that symphony came with a good deal of harmony and with a great deal of passion. By honoring Dr. Cordon Cardo as the Jacobi Medallion Award, we are honoring a man who will leave a legacy of mentorship, of uh, scientific innovation, of uh, translational research and cancer therapeutics. What an honor. What a wonderful moment for the department and for all of us to celebrate that our work is being recognized. I would hope that the legacy that we leave behind is that of a curious individual that has been able to change some of the paradigms. Leaving the door open to keep these paradigms, to keep changing, that's what gives me the strength to come to work every day. I feel proud to be part of this team 